Yellow. Musashi Miyamoto was the greatest samurai of his era. His philosophy for swordsmanship is applied to this day for the relevancy and encompassing nature it held with all things. He believed the sword and Ben were akin to each other, as if you were to learn one, learning the other would come naturally, and of course with his work, the Book of Five Rings, proved it. Thank you guys for joining me as I break down five quotes using Conor McGregor to exemplify Musashi Miyamoto's wisdom. Anger. Control your anger. If you hold anger towards others, they have control over you. Your opponent can dominate and defeat you if you allow him to get you irritated. Perfect example was Aldo and the psychological torture he endured under Conor McGregor's provocating personality. He crushed his spirit and dominated it before the fight even began, leaving him to crumble to his will. Fixation is the way to death. Fluidity is the way to life. Believing one method will win you the battle is an easy way to have your opponent study that method and use it against you. Learning all that you can in hopes to improve even by just a little is the key, and with Bruce Lee's philosophy no way is the way, Conor McGregor proves this. Always trying to expand upon his skill set and with a calm mind, letting it express itself naturally, fluidly, like water running down a slope at the moment's call. The path that leads to truth is littered with the bodies of the ignorant. The truth is not where we have not looked, it's where we refuse to look. When we let our arrogance, our beliefs inhibit us from opening our gaze to the truth before us, that's when the truth crushes us. The Gracies proved this with jujitsu, and, and now Conor McGregor with his calm mind and fluid movement is proving it today. The truth is an endless pursuit and end, but it's right before us. And if our ego is covering our eyes to it, expect to be amongst the bodies littered before it. When you decide to attack, keep calm and dash in quickly, forestalling the enemy. Attack with a constant feeling of crushing the enemy from first to last. This needs no explanation. From the way he speaks to the way he fights, he is always calm. But when the moment calls, snaps with an intent to kill, an unquenchable malice to destroy. It is imperative to master the principles of the art of war and learn to be unmoved in mind even in the heat of battle. In Conor vs. Diaz 2, despite his first loss to him, he regained himself and demonstrated this perfectly. Tired, gasping, taking blows to the mind, yet would not fall under pressure. He would not let his mind break from calm. He continued with his principles and even though he did not strike a finishing blow to the granite chin of Diaz, he made it out alive, with victory in hand. But the victory was not the most impressive part about that fight. It was the fact that his will was unwavered, regardless of the fact that he lost, regardless of the fact that everyone was against him, everyone thought he was going to lose. Regardless of all of that, he persevered and stood in that octagon against a giant man remaining calm and himself. And that was my video for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please don't forget to like and subscribe if you did, it's good karma. And until next time, peace.